Hey guys, welcome to my channel. It's Rachel of Gathered Plans. I have a haul for you. Kind of just grabbing whatever Happy Meal I have in my stash here. So this is gonna be all over the place. <laughs> so bear with me. Um, this is from Paper Trail Plans and I do have codes listed below, so be sure to check that out. Okay, so like I said, this is from Paper Trail Plans. Really beautiful, always love her packaging. Adore this rose gold butterfly, just so stunning. Amazing, I love these envelopes. And then I love that they don't um, use these so you can repurpose them. I know Honey Inked uses the same envelope, so really pretty. All right, let's see what I got here. I have my invoice on the side. Okay, so this was a pretty simple order. Um, here's the journaling card. Uh, Susie and Jess are the owners. I think it's a mom and daughter shop. Really beautiful. Ooh, yes, there's no like sticky stuff. Love that. Okay. So here is the Black Friday freebie. Adore this. Really stunning. Let me zoom you in. Really pretty. And then I think these were the other freebies as well. The shop freebie. I love the accents and her font. Their font I love. I just bought um, custom scripts from them. So these are the Starbucks run. I do prefer just like things that I mark like regularly. Um, just on black ink. I've been really preferring that simple style just because I feel like everything is so foiled. I like that just my writing and any scripts um, are in black. Other than like hello months or holiday scripts, I'm fine. And like the month scripts at the top, I'm fine with those being in foil. But adore these. I love the mix of the script and the print. And then here is the kit that I picked up. So they recently started doing kits and I'm very excited for them. So I can't wait. Um, I picked up three of their deco. Their deco is huge. So it is a full kit size. Sorry, my desk is a mess. Like I literally have stuff everywhere. Um, and I love this. Here it is up close so you can see everything. Kind of like individual pieces. I love the circle there. And then I'm just obsessed with the different bouquets. You have some of the clip art pieces, but the printing quality is so good. And I can tell you that genuinely looking at it, it's amazing. And this colorway is just stunning. So this kit is called um, Huge. I think that's how you pronounce it. And it's just, or yeah, Huga, um, Huga, Huga. Th that one. <laughs> Taking the time to slow down and, and feel the comfort and warmth of the simple things in everyday life. Really stunning. So here you have your full boxes and then you get some like quarter and almost third boxes down there. And then here, I think you kind of get more of these midi style boxes where they don't take up the full width. And then you get some quarter boxes, third boxes, um, three half or six half boxes here. You get some extra deco. So just in case, um, I recommend, honestly, I felt like I needed three <laughs> just because I didn't know how large these were gonna be um, just from looking at like a computer screen. But I think two is sufficient. Um, just because there's plenty on here and even if you don't use deco that much I recommend maybe just getting one and then there's also some that comes in the kit So just know that and then here you have some fancy boxes. I do love these ovals that they have Those are definitely my favorite. There are some flags checklist three different sets of headers. What are these? These are really cute. Oh, these are just some simple um Dividers just simple lines and then I really like their habit trackers are so chic and here's the bottom washi. This is definitely not really my style with how um, that foil on there. It's just not kind of like my cup of tea, but I'll probably end up using like an overlay instead. But I am obsessed with this um, fuzzy foiled top strip. That is so pretty. I do love this mauve color they picked. That's so stunning. That might not be the right color, so just don't hold me to that. <laughs> Some shapes. Obsessed with their day cover style. I love the um, swatch and ombre, it's just really pretty. Then you get like a sidebar checklist down here. So it is a very great um, four page formatted kit. Again, I did pick up three of the deco because I'm crazy. Um, and I also grabbed the Starbucks run in just black. So that's everything from Paper Trail Plans. My code with her is Rachel15 to save 15% off. Okay, so next I have two little bees. Ooh, satisfying that sound. <laughs> I just want to make sure my invoice does not show. Okay, great. I took my invoice out. This was um, Black Friday. I believe Paper Trail Plans and this one was Black Friday. 
I think I got a white jersey stationery Black Friday. This kit is called Tis the Season. I'm still not sure what I want to use for Christmas week yet. So I'm kind of going back and forth on a couple of kits and trying to figure out my lineup. I just feel like I was waiting on some stuff from Black Friday. So we shall see what I end up doing. But there are certainly not enough weeks in a year for all the kits I want to use. So with that being said, here is a um, just like a Valentine's freebie. Really pretty. And then here is my freebie. Beautiful. I love this. It, it matches the cafe. Um, kit that I recently used so pretty this is my freebie if you put my name in the notes to seller and also use my referral link love that she includes a doily and then this kit like I said it's called tis the season it's in gold foil it's so pretty I love the mint and the pink yeah this is this is so pretty it's definitely more Christmas themed so I really um, think I'm gonna end up using this for Christmas week and then, whoops. Oh, let me go into the format. Sorry, I'm super out of it. I haven't done a haul in so long. So here you get the full boxes. You get a washi strip down here. The full boxes are gorgeous. I love all of them. So pretty. Then here you get three sets of headers. I am obsessed with Two Little Bees format. I really love that Maria just like kind of wings every single kit and just depending on like what she includes, it makes it more fun and exciting in my opinion. Um, but you certainly get like the consistency of like the base of the kit But I do get excited for like different kinds of like florals or clip art and um, deco that she includes so Really pretty checklist love these circles and swatches like so she um, switches out a lot of boxes and stuff too This is super cute Hold on are those individually kiss cut I don't know then here you have some deco You get some flags Love these washi strips, like she changes up this as well. Love that, that's really popular recently is this arch. Um, and then you get some boxes. I'm obsessed with her boxes. I actually have a lot of her boxes in my collection, like these, just because they're so good. Just a simple border. I do want more that are more like um, the midi style. They don't take up the full width. And then here is the bottom washi, her signature bow, so stunning. The day covers, she's got some of my favorite day covers, but I love these. These are not boxed off, they're actually kiss cut. That is so pretty, Maria. And then here you get um, this really pretty full box that I'll probably end up using the sidebar in lieu of like that Monday through Sunday or checklist. You get an extra third box there. And then as always, <laughs> I picked up, um, I think I only got two of the deco and here's the reason why. Because this page has um, all of your fancy boxes and half scallops. You get tons of trims, which I appreciate that she does that. Very helpful for um, bottom, top, and day covers. Also love the really mini ones for icons. Um, and then you get some boxes that already have um, the deco. So that's the reason why I only got two of her full sheets of deco, because I feel like with that, as well as this, with this add-on page, you also get some deco on this page. So if you do not use a lot of deco, I recommend maybe just getting like just these two um, if you can swing it and then you also get some deco with the with the mini kit so definitely just a recommendation um, but yeah that is the tis the season kit super pretty can't wait to use that um, and so huge bummer <laughs> I really wanted to use this kit for a October or like October spread or just like a fall spread in general but I will probably hold on to this for next year just because, you know, I didn't get it in time for fall and I was so behind. I kind of like stopped buying kits for a while. Um, I kind of like fell out of the loop of purchasing stuff because I had so much going on. But I'll certainly end up using this for um, fall 2022. But this is super gorgeous. I'm obsessed with it. It is so stunning. I had to have it because I didn't know if she was going to re-release this for next year. It's called October Skies. And I did pick up three of the deco really pretty and then here it is it's in rose gold foil it's so pretty like the swing is just everything and I love the bench and then the bike like it just it's so pretty I love the blues as well it's not a very traditional like um, color I would think to use in fall your headers similar format your signature bow divider there I love the swatches or like the tape that she uses and then here's the bottom washi, really pretty. And then here are her day covers. Like I was saying, the other kit I showed you, it was kiss cut, this one is more squared off. This is her older format, I think, but I'm just obsessed with that bottom washi, it's so pretty. 
Okay. And then let's see what other page did I get? Oh yeah, I got um, this add-on page too. You get some extra deco. Like I said, I think this is maybe her older format. I'm not sure if she changed it again. Then you get the trims. Um, really pretty. I find myself struggling using these boxes because in my opinion, they're too small for myself. I know other people make them look good, but I feel like I don't have enough, um, I don't write small enough to fit in that, but I am obsessed with her other boxes. They're amazing. So this kit is called October Skies. I'm certainly going to save this for fall of 2022. Um, and probably same with this. This is called Hot Cocoa. Like I said, I was so behind on purchasing, um, or no, this isn't fall specific. This is winter specific. Duh, Rachel. Okay, so this kit is called Hot Cocoa. I think you can use this for fall or winter. It's really just up to you. Um, personally, I think it's perfect for winter because it's got snowflakes there. But I think like the colors kind of scream fall, right? So here I got three deco. Really gorgeous. I probably should have gotten an extra one. No, I think I'll be fine. Because I feel like these aren't large bouquets where I can um, trim them to make like, lo like long trims. Um, so, sorry guys, I'm like all over the place. My brain is like scattered. So here are the full boxes, bottom washi or like a washi strip, same format. I'm obsessed with these boxes. Those are so pretty. Really love her just simple line divider. bottom washi probably some of my favorite bottom washi is just her really thick foiled line in you know matched with the florals it's just so pretty and elegant your day covers these are kiss cut too so i wonder if she just does it every once in a while i don't know i love the kiss cut version that's really pretty and then um oh you get an extra this week that's nice instead of like a, a header you kind of get like a swatch i love her clipboards love these boxes so here is the add-on page. You get some extra deco too. Again, I love her mini deco that she includes up here because those are like the perfect size for icons. Um, and then the trims that she includes and just so pretty, love this. All right, so this kit is called Hot Cocoa. I'll probably use this for winter time. I think I, I, think I will actually. Um, this would be a really cute like camping or um, cabin trip too. Actually, I don't know. My, my brain is just like going in 20 million directions. <laughs> Right now but I am the most excited for this kit to use for of course like this week because it is Christmas as I'm filming this um, I'm filming this on Christmas Eve but I think I'm gonna definitely use this to memory plan Christmas week so that is everything from two little bees again I do have a referral link for her it's, it's below and here is my freebie so be sure to put my name in the notes to sell her all right, so white dare stationery here, and as always, I always have something in my hauls with her. Um, I do have a referral link below. This is a Canadian shop, so depending on where you are in the world, the conversion is very nice, and I usually always get um, free shipping as well. So that's how it looks packaged. Um, here is her wax paper that I always tear. Yep. <laughs> And then I do love her freebies and I definitely save them because they're so useful and there's a lot of fun, cute things and new things on here. I think she actually changed her freebie. Let me see. Oh no, maybe she didn't. Let me try to... Ugh. Yeah, she did change her freebie. So she... I remember there only being three rows. So there usually were three rows. Now she maximized it and put four. That is amazing. Definitely very smart, you know... Uh, maximizing the space but just an even better freebie now because you get so much more I love this I literally have almost everything on here <laughs> super cute so that's a freebie again I do have a referral link below so if you want to save some money be sure to use that and then here it is a lot of these are restocks I just finished using a full sheet of these brown ones um, Lauren actually got me into using these clipboards because I've always had them and I like never really used them so I'm really happy that um, Lauren inspired me to use them again because I do love foiling it up um, or flooring floor floraling floraling it up try saying that really fast um, really beautiful so like the brown ones especially for fall and winter there's a lot of kits with browns in them so it's it definitely comes in handy and then I love these feather dusters super cute I had to get another stethoscope just because um, I can't believe I'm running low, but this has held me off for like two years. Like one sheet of these held me off for like two and a half years now. And then here is the gift box, super adorable. Love this campfire. I still haven't um, 
back plan my cabin week just or my cabin trip just because I knew I was waiting on these guys so definitely wanted to hold off on those and so she recently did a um oh that's what I did I bought two of these in the colorway her traditional colorway because you know throughout the rest of the year like I, I find that I can't use the brown that's probably why I didn't find a lot of good use for this color but now that she offered it in this signature colorway I'm so excited so good I'm really glad that she did that so I grabbed two and then I had to grab another house I love just using this to mark like when I have family or friends coming over um, sometimes I don't have a very specific kind of icon to mark that so I just love using the house and then this charcuterie board is so cute. I make charcuterie boards like it's my job. <laughs> so obsessed. It's just really detailed. Let me see. Can you see that? So cute. I'm obsessed. I'm just concerned um, that it won't match the colorway. So I think it's kind of like light enough that I think it should match spreads, but we shall see. I don't know how she would go about making this like this colorway. You know, I don't know. And then here are the box of ornaments. This is really cute. Oh my gosh, I could have used this to mark decorating my tree, but um, oh, bummer. Really cute. I'll probably use that next year. Maybe like putting away the Christmas tree. I don't know. Here is the book spine. Love this. I've been reading a lot. Um, this is super cute. So this is the sticky note. I thought these were going to be bigger, to be honest with you. These are tiny. Can you see that? Look how small that is. <laughs> Let me show you guys. Um, that's how small. <laughs> this is so I'm not really sure how I'm gonna use these maybe I can use it to mark like a time like put it like a box right like let me see so I have my collab boxes out right now so let's use this as an example um maybe if I did that to like mark a meeting like in the bottom would that be cute and then like maybe put the time in the post-it I don't know I think that could be adorable I'm just a little bit bummed. I didn't realize it was going to be this tiny. <laughs> oh gosh. It's okay. It's okay. It's fine. I really can't stand laying things back down on a sticker because I never, I never get it. And then the gift wrapping. So fun fact, I didn't really um, buy a lot of gifts at all, like physical stuff this year. If anything, I was sending out like gift cards um, and like getting cash for <laughs> my sister. But like, I, I feel like this year is very different for gifts. Like I think me and my family were just like, we're not going to do anything really big for Christmas. Uh, like, it's just going to be strictly like spending time with people and not be super into like buying stuff. So I don't know. This year is very different. Let me know if that hit for you that the same way this year as well. Um, it's just a very odd, weird year. So I don't know, but really pretty. I love this makeup brush holder. These are teeny tiny, but I do love the size. I like just like the whole look of this. I like her utensils one too. It's probably one of my favorite stickers, um, the, ut the utensil cup with the actual utensils in them to mark cooking. But I love the makeup one to mark just like putting on makeup, adore that. I have so many makeup icons now. And then laptop and coffee, so cute. And then, okay, I was so appreciative because, listen, I forgot, um, someone actually DM'd me and was like, oh my gosh, um, cause I think I reshared uh, the sale. I think this was the Black Friday sale. And I remembered someone DM'd me and said, I can't believe I forgot the sticker stickers. And I'm like, what are you talking about? And I, I think the reason I forgot them is because they're so light. They're pretty much just all white, you know? Um, it was literally on the first page, maybe the second or third listing and I completely missed it. So I reached out to the shop owner to see if she could add it to my order because I already placed the order and I was so, so sad. But basically if you, I don't think you can even see, but um, if you look up close in person, there are tiny little laptops. Like this is the sticker sheet with the laptops on it. And I think it's adorable. I love sticker stickers, like sticker sheet stickers. <laughs> they're the cutest thing ever. I just think they're adorable. The size is super cute too. And it's pretty neutral where there's not too much color in it, you know? And then this is the, um, maybe this should have gone first, but this is the first 50 orders Black Friday exclusive. Oh, okay, that's awesome. Yes, I love this. This is just like best selling doodles. That's cool. It's really cool to see the best selling ones. I love her utensils. They're my favorite thing to use. And the houses, oh, so good. 
Okay, all right, so that is everything from White Jar Stationery. My referral link for her is below. Be sure to check them out. Um, shipping from Canada, like she does a tremendous job. I get my stuff really quickly. And um, also she just has like the best freebies, very functional. And I love that they're all like hand-drawn doodles. Like they're amazing. Her color palette matches pretty much everything and super affordable whenever it comes to the conversion. So be sure to check that out. And again, use my referral link below. All right guys, so this next kit is Sunlight and here are the deco add-ons. You get the, um, you have options of getting the floral deco and the journaling deco on transparent or white paper. And then here are the full boxes. This is in gold foil. Bottom washi, love the blues and greens. All of your extra boxes. And then here is the journaling add-on. Really pretty. I'm really excited. I haven't planned with um, one of her new formats just yet with like the journaling add-on, so I'm excited to play around with that. So I have a ton more Sadie stickers <laughs> kits to go through here. So this next one is really beautiful, also perfect for spring. I'll go through them pretty quickly just because you guys are familiar with the um, layout now. This would be a really pretty like um, winery kit too. Beautiful bottom washi, so stunning. Love the pops of red in this one. I'm not a huge fan of red, but I feel like when never done well, it just, it's so good. All right, so that's Wildflower. Next is Blossom. This screams Lauren to me. <laughs> I immediately thought of her when I saw this kit. Um, here are the add-ons. But I love it too. It's such a perfect, like, perfect spring kit. I love the storefront. Probably some of my favorite things. And then this, like, like garden. It's so cute. Like, the um, mobile, mobile garden, I guess. I don't know. Bottom washi, day covers. Love the fuzzy foil. This is in gold. And then here's the journaling add-on. Obsessed with that truck with the umbrella and garden, that is so cute. So this kit is called Blossom. Again, all of these are still available in her shop. This next kit is called Parisian. This is so good too. Such a pretty Valentine's kit. Here are the add-ons. This is in rose gold, love the hearts, that is so pretty. And the bike, I'm a sucker for the bikes. Obsessed with this new um, update too. She did a thinner strip and a thicker strip. So pretty. All right, this kit is called Parisian. And then this next kit is a really, really pretty, um, it can be used as a winter kit in my opinion or just like any uh, December Christmas kit too because of the candy canes but I feel like if you don't end up wanting to use this for like a Christmas or holiday specific kit you can just take this full box out and then everything else is pretty like perfect for winter so it's called hot chocolate here is the deco add-on you guys know I love green and it's rose gold so already winning <laughs> bottom washi love these neutrals they're so pretty boxes And then this journaling page is so good. So this kit is called Hot Chocolate. This next kit is called Grow. And here are the add-ons. This is in gold foil. This bathtub scene is so pretty. I wish I had that in my house. That is so pretty. This is definitely giving me more of the tropical vibes for sure. Probably because of course like the plants and stuff, but this would be like a really great um, maybe spring into summer kind of kit. Really pretty. This one is incredibly stunning. This was so popular when it released. This is called Amelia. And it's just so pretty. I love the aerial view of um, a girl at the desk. I just think it's probably some of the prettiest things. And I think Alicia actually had like a journaling card or a album with that design before. So really pretty, the colors are just everything. And this bottom washi. I just love how serene the colors are.
All right, so this is called Amelia. I still have a lot of um, deco um, add-ons to uh, to add to these because I ordered some after the fact, and I can't wait to grab them just because I feel like um, one is not gonna be enough for me, you know? So you'll probably see that in another haul. So here is the February 2022 kit. This is the weekly, and here are the add-ons. Really pretty. This reminds me a lot of her cherry blossom kit she did last year. Or this year, this past year. <laughs> I can't, I can't keep up, guys. Very light pastel. Really pretty. And then here is the monthly. So like I said before, I'm going to try to, um, I'm not going to do any of my monthlies from 2021 just because I just can't. I'm so behind from literally January. <laughs> so what I think I'm going to do is start um, actually doing them as soon as the month ends starting end of January and doing more of a decorative thing plus like maybe one highlight every few days or something or like picking the best highlights of that month. Really pretty. Gosh, this is so setting and this is her newest format. So she has the option of a checklist sidebar as well. And then the um, deco add-on. So I do love picking up the large deco to supplement the weekly kit. And then you can do vice versa and get like the weekly kit to supplement the monthly. It's just really pretty to have the um, different variety and options. And then here's the journaling page as well. So that's the February monthly. And this kit is perfect for spring as well. It's called Garden. Here are the add-ons. So pretty. Again, hopefully this will help you guys, you know, pick your lineup for your spring kits because, you know, winter I, I know is still um, happening right now, but spring will be here before we know it. And I think having your lineup will be perfect. So you can see all of the beautiful spring kits. So that is called Garden. And then this one was super popular as well. This is called Typewriter. It's a really great anytime kit. And here are the add-ons. Just so stunning. It reminds me a lot of Amelia with the colorway. So pretty. And here's the journaling page. So that is everything from Sadie Stickers. I know it was a ton. <laughs> So that is everything from her shop. And um, again, here is my freebie. Oh, it actually, oh, stop it. My freebie matches so well with typewriter. So FYI, if you want to get the typewriter kit, put my name in the notes of seller to get my freebie. It will match perfectly. So that is everything. My code with her is Rachel20 to save 20% off. So this box is from Jackson Pepper. I just wanted to show you the beautiful packaging really quickly. Let's see if my invoice is in here. Yep, I'll probably flip that over really quick. But it came in a box because I wanted to snag this beautiful um, tote. It is so pretty. Let me open this. I'm in love with how this looks. It is so pretty. <laughs> it's so it's so gorgeous. Excuse my super messy desk. Like this is my life, but so pretty. I love how wide it is, and it's shorter in height. This is a perfect, perfect tote. I love this. Definitely gonna come in handy for just like groceries or doing errands. So pretty. I love the print and just the botanical. It just, it's literally chef's kiss. It's so pretty. So this is available at Jackson Pepper as well, just in case you were interested. And then let's get into the stickers. One second, let me take my invoice out. All right, so here are the freebies. All right, here are the freebies. This actually matches a kit. And then this is clean eating. It matches a kit as well. I think she had like an exclusive kit. And I love when she does these. Um, these are the winter, this is the winter bucket list. Super adorable. It's not foiled. It's just um, clip art and super adorable. And, oh yes, can't wait. Um, ooh, are these new? These are the scalp dividers. I don't know if she did. Um, oh, okay, so here's like more of a um, the left one is the hand-drawn scallop divider, and then this one is not hand-drawn, I don't think, but it's a little bit thicker, but these are the ones you guys see me use often. Let me see if I can find one that I already have. 
like this. They used to come on like a $2 sheet. So love these gold and I love her new gold. Um, I don't know if it's new, but I do love her, uh, what's it called? Her matte gold. It's so stunning. This is kind of mixed up. So here is the really pretty foil florals. I don't know if this, why this is mixed up. Let's fix it. All right, so here are the gold ones, both hand-drawn and not. Really pretty. And then here is silver. And then here is rose gold. All right, so here are the transparent pattern um, boxes that I got. So I did want them to, I don't know if they um, are supplementing the kits. Yeah, I just got these intentionally for journaling. I love them. And I just prefer the pattern squares because they're my favorite out of the different options that Lena has to offer, but they're just so stunning. So this is the um, lingering season one. I do have a kit that matches this, but I do get the transparent matte um, journaling pattern squares are so pretty. Here is the reset one, so stunning. And then here is the new season one. Adore this one. This is the Scandinavian winter. How cute is this? These houses or the barn, so, so pretty. And then here is the winter celebration one. So pretty, wow. And then these are the transparent brush strokes. So this is for October. I, I think I only grabbed um, October colorway because it's pretty neutral, really pretty. And then here are the um, kits that I got. And then I also wanted to pick up extra deco for some other kits. So I think for new season, I did grab an extra deco because I think um, one wasn't gonna be enough for me. And then here is also the freebie that came with the, the order, so that's perfect. And then here is the reset kit. So she does have, she did have a reset kit before and you guys might've remembered me using it, but it was probably one of my favorite plan with me's ever. Just obsessed with the greens and the browns and earthy tones, but she kind of reformatted and like did different pictures. So you get your full boxes, checklist, and then your third box is down there. Day covers, bottom washi, rose gold foiling. Here are some washi or header strips. And then love these midi boxes, your half boxes, quarter boxes, third boxes. Obsessed with her new scallops, her scallop headers. You get some extra deco here as well. All of your trackers and more headers at the bottom. And then here I grabbed um, <laughs> three of the, the deco because I have no chill but also because I love cutting up deco and just going crazy and she does space them out a lot. So I feel like you could compress this on like a quarter sheet and um, it's not as much as it looks when you look at a big piece of paper. Does that make sense? So that is reset. And then here is clean eating. I think this was an exclusive, but it's so good. I love this baby blue she used. It's really pretty. Wow, this is so pretty. I love it. So same format. Oops. I've said this before, but Lena's shop is amazing. I have been obsessed with her design for such a long time. She was probably one of the first shops I um, really, really fell in love with and have consistently always supported since I started this hobby. So she is still amazing. Love her so much. And her designs are just literally so chic, elegant, just amazing. So here's the deco add-on. Love this circle, that's so pretty. So many ideas already. These florals are stunning, so good. I hope you guys were able to get your hands on this clean eating one, because I think it was only an exclusive for Black Friday, if I remember correctly. But um, yeah, that is everything from Jackson Pepper. My code with her is Rachel15 for 15% off. Super stoked for these um, dividers here. They're so, so good.